Hey, this is Lady, and I'm back with another book talk. Today's book talk will be about two books by Craig Thompson, Habibi, and Blanket. So let's get into it. Sure, I got somebody watching this who is a fan of the movie The Color Purple. And if you remember them asking Sophia after she got out of jail, Miss Sophia, how you feeling? And she's sitting there, she's she rocking, and she said, confused. That's that's what describe how I feel after reading Habibi by Craig. Thompson. It's Habibi by Craig Thompson. I I talked about I got it in a library hall and I read this book. Okay. So, first of all, I have saw reviews on it and it got such good reviews, but nobody really went into what it was about. All they said is two orphans, Middle East and their survival. I had no idea all of the misogyny. I had no idea there would be eunuchs with castration. I had no idea there would be so much forced rape and um, harems and just a uh, little bit of racism and all of that in this book. I just was just shocked. Um, first getting to some things that I did like about it. I liked um, some of the stories, biblical stories that were told, uh, some of the scriptures that was um, talked about from the Bible as well as the Quran. Um, I love the illustration in the book, which is awesome. It is in black and white, and it's just gorgeous. It's gorgeous, but... I mean, it's also so much nudity um, throughout the book. Uh, and I just don't know. I'm like, like I said in the beginning, I'm confused. That is so pretty. Everything is so pretty. But I'm just confused part partially because I never really read a book, uh, you know, of this storyline with um, so much just... I don't know I don't know but it was a book of survival and it was a book um, about love in which I enjoyed it the two main characters is Dodola I think I'm pronouncing that correctly and Cham Dodola is a nine-year-old girl who is sold into marriage for money by her family she is of course her husband is this old man and within the first five pages you see them um, What's the word I'm looking for? Commensurate their marriage. Commemorates. What it was. Y'all know the word I'm talking about. You know what happens in the first five pages with a nine year old adult man. Uh, that was a bit much. Okay, so then her husband dies and she becomes a slave. That's where she meets Cham, who is a three year old black boy. This is all takes place in the Middle East, so he's African. Um, from where in Africa I'm not sure but she takes care of him they move to the desert to this abandoned um, boat and that's where they live for several years um, and they survive um, eventually something happens I won't spoil it but they are separated and then they go and live separate lives until hey who knows do they come back together or not I won't share that um, what's this book a page turner yes it was did it have me like confused yes it did um, I don't know I, I liked it I guess I, I'll let's get to the next one blankets is by Craig Thompson as well like I said and this one is supposed to be his story as a young boy growing up he has a younger brother he lives with his mother and father who are very religious people and he um, it's a love story about a girl he meets and how they um, are able to spend some time together and they met at a um, Christian camp one winter his family actually sent him to a christian camp now hey i'm a christian but i've never been to a christian camp i guess vacation bible school but anyways this book was good but i felt like something was missing even though habibi had me just like all over the place emotionally 
with um what was going on and what they went through um this book it wasn't as much of a roller coaster um it was a sweet book is how i would describe it um again black and white illustrations and i read that um one or if not both took about six years in illustration alone so that's that's awesome that's really awesome um the guy he grows up and he begins to question um you know his christian values and things of the bible again both of these stories had a very um biblical a lot of biblical references this one even had those breakdowns of different um biblical stories and i really did enjoy that okay after my confusion i'm like which one which one did i like 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 and of the two i'm gonna have to go with habibi like I said, I was just something that I wasn't used to and I'm not going to give it any low marks because the subject matter was so wild cuz this could easily possibly you know be what somebody's doing for survival, but I just was thrown off. I was thrown off. So, that's it for this book talk with these two books by Craig Thompson, Blankets, and Habibi. If you have read either of these books, let me know what you thought. Let me know what did you think. They were both very good, very well illustrated. The stories were pretty good. I just, you know, by it being something totally different from me, I, I was just like, mm, I don't know, I don't know. But, like I said, if you have read these books, let me know in the comment section below. Again, this is Lady, and I thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.